Hey guys, you just let us know that the Venom The Last Dance trailer has come out. This is Venom 3. I'm excited I'm that not. we're teasing at fucking Venom and, and Spider-Man and MCU and this and that. So let's see what they're going to do with the third Venom. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. Eddie. Oh my God. What? Why the, the stupid start of the bit? All right. Now we actually start. We are in, I don't know, the... You should probably know that I have a really The body of... An unpredictable side to me. Stop speaking. I'm giving you a chance, sweetie. Oh, look, he's being so nice. Look at this guy's tats. Gwen. <laughs> yeah, you're not gonna get it. He's bulletproof. What? <laughs> okay. What? Are you? We are vet. We are. No. Yeah, we. We are. We are gonna need to work on that. <laughs> ah, what? Hey. What was it? All the finest places. Oh. So. Uh. <laughs> That's like the worst parts of the Sony Venom all together. The bloodless, head biting, cringe. and the cringe jokes. Right there. Is that how this is going to be? And then we've got the slow down uh, song. Yeah. Bobby, wait. And it's our job to make sure wait, was it, the wasn't the piece in the MCU? Are they retconning this? I have no cool. idea anymore. What it, those guys are gonna break their legs! What do you even <laughs> What? Okay, military versus venom underwater. Uh, we got uh, Las Vegas! And the lady who runs the store He dances with the last dance and another big CGI monster. His home and planet. More. more symbiotes, baby. Jesus. <laughs> Jesus Christ, exactly. That plane is so There's fucked. That cannot be beaten. As long as lives, what the hell is that? Oh, that's the cop. Yeah. Well, then. You may not make it out of this alive, buddy. <laughs> Tom Hardy's that voice is so weird. Yeah. I don't know why he does that. For his uh, Venom voice. The last dance. Oh, is that it? You think you can get that thing to go without killing it? Oh my! Oh, we got a Venom horse. <laughs> Venom horse with really bad CGI. We. Okay, well, ah, uh, do they part? Well, coming off the last one, let there be carnage. Yeah, I was not a big fan. <laughs> I didn't really enjoy it. It was weird seeing uh, Woody Harrelson. Woody Harrelson, yeah, it's carnage. Uh, this, I don't have any faith. Again, it's I. I'm not really a big fan of the way they're doing. Sony's doing Venom. Yeah, I wasn't a big fan first one. Second one got even worse. Third one, not a lot of hope. It's still Sony. I'm not excited for this, unfortunately. Uh, you know, I I liked the first one except for the CGI monster smashing battle at the end. They got worse. With and the then it got worse with thing. the uh, you know, with Carnage. I'm still upset at them for wasting Carnage. Yes. Can't believe Sony's like one and done, and that's the. <laughs> No, no, I, I'm not looking forward to the military <laughs> fighting Venom because they really want his help because more Venom symbiotes are coming to the planet. No, where is Spider-Man? You don't just fucking bait and switch people. You don't just set it up and then we're going to do this. Yeah, he went into the MCU and then he learned about Tom Holland and then I guess he got sucked back into the Sony universe and left the symbiote behind. 
But then this trailer shows a little piece of the symbiote in the Sony verse. So are they retconning it? The, no, that bar wasn't in the MCU. That was in the Sony verse the whole time. We yeah, watch kidding. the movie and find out the end. We, we're just kidding. <laughs> there were plot leaks and rumors that, you know, uh, fine. If you can't do Tom Holland, Andrew Garfield would be the Spider-Man. and Because he was Spider-Verse. He was Sony, you know. So, man, like. That's like the stuff I was looking forward to is Venom and Spider-Man. It's like, this is what I wanted for the third film. It's like you're rushing through it. You you, you wasted carnage. So fine. Finally give us what we really wanted, which was uh, Venom and Spider-Man. Instead, we get Venom and, I guess, Toxic or Null or the, his his planet coming to invade the Earth. Uh, I'm I'm... Not excited about this one. It looks to be another disaster. Now, don't get me wrong. At, at this point, we all know it's silliness, okay? The Tom Hardy Venom has the silly, has the jokes, and I guess we're fine with that. I just thought by the third film, they're like, all right, we got three films. Let's let's try to do something different. Let's, let's make it more horror. Let's make it more serious. Or... Let, let's do Spider-Man. No, instead, they're leaning into all of the things. With, they're leaning into more comedy. They're leaning into more CGI. The crazy horse. <laughs> CGI boss battles. And and instead of having a female Venom, now we have a fucking super fast horse with terrible CGI. No, this doesn't look good, man. Uh, what do you think, Alex? Oh, I hate it. I mean, this is the studio that brought us Madam Web, right? And, and, and Morbius, yeah. and, and Venom, and Venom Two. Um, yeah. Look this, at his leg. Woo. This is a movie that risks nothing, and so it will accomplish nothing because it's not violent. And so they'll they'll do a little bit of violence because it's PG thirteen because um, they have oh, they don't yeah. have the the clackers yeah. To, yeah. to to do anything like that. So it's it's a movie made for kids um, because there's no violence in it. The it's going to be pared down. It's not funny. I don't think they've got good writers. So I don't think that it's going to be humorous enough to, to make me want to watch it. So yeah. we'll get a shitty um, bad guy that will be super CG. They'll be clashing together. Characters we don't care about. And I don't think that anyone, look, even based on this, I don't think cut. anyone should go to the theater and watch this. <laughs> like, look. It's a clean cut. Yeah. Look, his head just literally disappears. He bites down. Nothing happens. There's no, there's no. There can There's be not even any splatter, and it then the head just disappears. It can't be. It's so stupid. Why can't it be? Well, because they want. Why can't they just do R? Well, because they don't want to risk anything, right? Uh, uh, you know, for ugh, this is ridiculous. Are they saying to the censors, no, no, everybody has their head done. Everybody has their head done like this. That's what really happened. You can remove the heads. You just can't show any of the blood. <laughs> it has to look as the stupidest possible thing that you could imagine. Maybe they got exercised a lot and they got very low blood pressure. <laughs> is that what it is? That's what it is. Oh my Oatmeal gosh. in the morning. It's like military uh, chasing venom. Here's the part I'm talking about. You remember when they left the symbiote yes. behind? I thought that, you know, I then clearly the symbiote left behind in the MCU is probably maybe still there or they're retconning the whole thing because you're showing a bar and the sy uh, symbiote piece. But Sony's so stupid that they don't realize that that confuses people. This is probably in the Sony-verse and Venom got a piece of it or maybe asteroids are landing and this is the symbi a piece of the symbiote of a symbiote army that's invading and that's how this general finds out and he's like all right we got a we have an army coming and we need venom's help or we need to study venom we need to dissect venom uh, so that we can understand how to defeat him mm -hmm. and then you've got the super soldiers with the lenses that's their uniqueness you can and tell these, yeah. these better be sonic guns yeah, at the very <laughs> least no they're, they're, they're electricity the, guns because they're, they're zapping well, they, should, they zapped them earlier under okay water. whatever Zip. this is the dumbest design ever it kind of looks cool for a trailer shot but this guy's like all right you what better, happened hold your legs this, in that position this just reminds me of that leg, little the little zen thing yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Something's in his like, oh, no. oh, Yes, it. exactly. <laughs> They're like, oh, stop hitting me. <laughs> it's not me. <laughs> okay. Now, if the movie just said, fuck it, and they got that Might stupid and crazy, 
B movie, then I'd be on board. But if you I was know, Venom, I saw that. I was like, oh, I know what I'm fucking I'm doing. I know what I'm fucking doing. We'll give you one extra whole point for that, which is good because I'm already subtracting one whole point for bait and switching the fucking Spider-Man thing at the end of Venom 2. I'm at like and a three. Then not gar- and not giving us... Okay, I was about to say, they're about to break their fucking legs because I thought they, I didn't see the water right right here. So, yeah, they're jumping in the water with him. And then they're going to fucking shock him, I guess. Um, he's out in the desert. I'm not really sure he, where he's at. Is he in Mexico, yeah, Nevada, yeah. something like that? Uh, and then eventually he meets up with um, the convenience store lady and has a dance with her. I guess that's referencing the last dance. How do these characters factor in? I they don't see really him walking care. around and they pick him up. <clears throat> oh, they're hippies. Yeah, yeah. more jokes. Uh, here comes the main CGI villain that uh, he's going to have to do battle with. This huge symbiote. It looks like one of the symbiote. monsters from, I think it's, was it Guardians of the Galaxy they fought? Oh, I was thinking uh, The Quiet Place or something like that. I was That's thinking, a little mixture. yeah, like Quiet Place yeah, slash uh, like Star yeah. Wars, um, Solo, or, or, or which, no, maybe it was, I don't know, remember the, the, the particular creature that he, he captures and puts into the Millennium Falcon. Oh, yeah. But I guess that's more just a big the, mouth. Yeah. Uh, but, oh, see, so here it is do in all of its glory. They're gonna. You think they're going to do there's something on the wing? There's something on the plane joke? Because <laughs> yeah. they're like, hey, Twilight remember, Zone. Hey, remember that thing that we... Gremlins. Yeah. Well, all I know is this plane better be fucked. It better be falling out of the sky. And that's Venom what I'm saying. Because there's no... something creative you know. to stop it. Because we've never really seen, you know, Spider-Man you know stop a plane uh from crashing we've seen superman do it in not homelander and brian singer <laughs> no homelander <laughs> helps <laughs> helps wreck the plane He's like, well, and we ignore there's, it there's no time we there's, gotta go we gotta go i don't know what what i think usually saves these films for me is tom hardy and the voice of venom like those two elements work. It's just everything else around it with the Oof. Sony's in it's charge a lot. of. It's <laughs> That's a, lot. a lot, and uh, it's usually not enough to save the film, uh, frankly. So I don't know how excited people are, but I mean, I don't want to get insulting or anything. But it's like when you see this and you're getting super excited. Like, what kind of person are are you? It's like. Is this what gets people excited these days? I mean, we have to go somewhere interesting. And this just looks like a rehash of the last two films just with a different CGI villain. Are we really going anywhere new? Oh, the symbiote army is invading. I don't give a fucking shit. And I'm just... I'm, I guess it's, I'm just really upset that we don't get the Spider-Man uh, Venom crossover that we were promised or hinted at. Um, and I would even be up for, you know the leaks which was andrew garfield is in this one like that version of spider-man for is three seconds it. at the very end if you... probably uh you know uh, i guess that's that at this point is the best that we can hope for the end andrew of- <laughs> garfield three second cameo maybe not even as spider-man just as andrew garfield the actor getting a bag of cheetos in the store that's probably what we can look for these movies make me not like venom yeah and that's hard to do <sighs> So it's like, what the fuck? I've been waiting for him to get his old logo across his chest, you know. And Just they, they, the, the one thing they got right was, you know, his his, size, his design, yeah. his design, his size. I like it. Um, I just don't like every film. <laughs> him going up against a CGI monster at the end. Do you think they're going to do the thing they did in the first one and the second one where they have a little tiff and they're mad at each other for like the majority of the movie? And then uh, because <laughs> yes, you, no, uh, do you think we're done with that. Finally? Point, we're done with that uh, and so. we're in full cooperation and they're just having fun together. As you can see here in this very cringe scene where it's like, we are, Venom. we, you're supposed to do the line, right? And this is such a crowd pleaser. <laughs> you know, I don't pay the line. We have been. Oh, but he said it funny. Because they're not on the same page. We are. We are Venom. 
Oh, he's so excited. He just wants to finish. We are. Venom! No. Oh. Yeah, we. We are. Venom. We're going to need to work on that. And then the tone is like, you, you, you might need to work on that. One frame later, his head is severed from his body and no blood comes out. It's like. All right. Anyways. Um, <laughs> our very, very negative uh, view of the trailer. Go ahead and downvote us or tell us why we're You're wrong. You've seen the first two. No, maybe not. They, yeah, they, they loved, yeah. I, everybody loved the first two, right? I can see people liking the first one because I did like the first one. It's just that third act falls that apart. That is fine. But if you like I the Carnage know. one, I, there's something wrong no. with you. Something, <laughs> something wrong with you, it boy. It started going down, so, so I expect this, obviously. To All be right. maybe on par with the second one. Maybe on par with Morbius. <laughs> Madam Web. Ooh. It's better than Madam Web because Tom Hardy and Venom are in it. So yes. that already, and there's there's battles. I mean, there's nothing in Madam Web, uh, which was a hit on Netflix, by the way, because everybody wanted to see how bad it was. <laughs> I think this will be uh, worse than the first one. And better than Carnage, so to be right there in the middle of mediocre and hardly watchable. That's some good expectations. Yeah. All right. And then, like like Alex said, like a three second cameo of a Spider Man tease. Yeah. Uh, and th they pretend that none of that stuff in the la at the end of the last film ever happened. I don't know. Um, hopefully, Sony and Marvel do have a plan for that in the future. Because how can you tease fans and then years later just like act like it's it's not happening? So I guess we have to wait till number four. No, this is the this is the last dance. There can oh. be no other dance. This is the last dance. With Venom four. Okay, Spider Man four. We'll get finally get the symbiote like there. The start of Secret Wars that the black suit will mar merge with Tom Holland or Tom Holland's replacement if he doesn't want to do it anymore, and then Secret Wars <gasps> or team or, or team up. Madam Web, Morbius, and Venom have to take on um, Craven. Craven. Can no. I get Topher Grace back in here? Oh no. Um, no. On Topher Grace. No. Topher Grace's version of Venom. No. <laughs> and then and then this Tom Hardy bites his head off bloodlessly. There you go. There you go. <laughs> All right. There we got we got the fourth movie ready for you, Sonny. <laughs> You're doing such dumb shit, you might as well fucking take it. All right? Thank you all so much. We'll see you on the next Angry Joe Show. Bye.